I keep a skeleton key for a dungeon where I eat hell MCs as a delicacy. Hey, what up? Thank you for the follow. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll check you out. What kind of games do you play? Oh, you recently got you recently got affiliate. Congratulations, that's awesome. Uh, looks like um, <clears throat> looks like you're recently playing Demon Souls. How do you like that game? The Dark Souls series is one of my all-time favorite games. Game series, I guess. <laughs> that's awesome, though. I want a PS5 so bad. <laughs> yeah, I mean, those, um, those games are, uh, I mean, they're, they're kind of difficult, but, uh, it's really just about persistence and, uh, and, uh, what do you call it? I incremental progress. What up, Phantom? How you doing? I know a lot of people get frustrated with games like, um, even like Mario Kaizo or Dark Souls or a lot of roguelikes, but, um, you really just have to get in the mindset of it's not about beating full levels at, the, at a time or about beating the game. It's about just kind of like beating your best progress every time. <laughs> I'm doing pretty good. Um, trying, trying to learn how to speed run this game. I figured since I beat the game in about four hours, I, I could probably get like a less than one hour um, speed run time with some practice. I've always wanted to learn how to speed run a game, and so far I haven't done a great job. I tried to do Borderlands, and I tried to do Super Meat Boy. And, uh, hasn't worked out too bad, <laughs> or, or too well. <clears throat> There's a new Super Meat Boy? I know he put out that game, was like the end of the Meat Boy Forever? No, I haven't seen that. I thought you were going to say the, um, what was it? Wasn't, wasn't that game the end of the world or whatever that he put out? Wasn't that similar to Super Meat Boy? Oh, Auto Runner? That sounds awesome. I'll have to check it out. I didn't even know it existed. I, like, I love Super Meat Boy. I obviously love Binding of Isaac. But, uh, I haven't played all of his games. Because there's the, the standalone Bumbo game, too, that I've never played. Oh, I thought, I thought the door was going to get both of them. Yeah, this game's cool, and I'm I'm um I'm playing in speedrun mode, so it's cutting all the story out. But the the story of this game is really good. Um, I don't know if you've ever played Hotline Miami, but it's the same developer, and it has kind of a similar style where it's like a psychedelic story about like veterans, like war veterans, and how you know the the two interact. 
whoever made all these games definitely either is a veteran or has a veteran in, in their family. Oh, jeez. I always do that. So yeah, I'm not the, uh... I still haven't completed a speedrun of this game, but... I'm definitely, uh, getting there. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Thanks for stopping by. I'll, uh... I'll give you a watch next time you're on. Yep, so one thing I don't do here is you're supposed to keep a weapon, so you can just th throw a weapon and hit him off the edge without, um... Without having to wait, wait for the animation for him to jump off. You can just... I have Hotline Miami 2, but I haven't, uh, I haven't beat it. I beat the first one. This part, I don't have down yet. There we go. I'm getting, I'm getting better at that. Jumping out of their, jumping out of their line of sight. You're supposed to just stand and wait for them to, uh, Hotline Miami, Hotline Miami is my number one, um, number one game that I want to be made into a TV show, because I think it would make a great, like, dark Breaking Bad kind of drama. So the soundtrack, <laughs> soundtrack for Hotline Miami and for this game, pretty banging. Oh, there we go. Totally. Did you see? Um, I don't know how much Fall Guys you play. I don't play a whole lot, but they have. Uh, Jacket as a skin in Fall Guys because they're both uh, produced by the same studio. <laughs> it's not my favorite game, but, you know, it was popular when I first started on, um, started streaming on Switch. I'm, I'm definitely ready for some new multiplayer games to be, um, get popular on Switch. Because <clears throat> I'm kind of over Fall Guys, and I'm... Definitely over uh, Among Us.
But the, the, yeah, this this game feels a lot like Hotline Miami, just you know, platformer instead of top down. Oh, all right, we got this. Ooh. Yeah, it, 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 it looks like it did. Which is fine by me. The problem I always had with it, and it wasn't really a problem with the game, it was more so the people I played with, is that they would play together all the time. So they would have like a really good idea of everyone else's play style, and then I would play like once every two weeks, and they would just immediately know if I was the uh, if I was the imposter or not, just because they they know everyone else. So I'm kind of like the odd one out. But the uh, the goddamn minecart level. So yeah, nothing against the developers, but... <laughs> Just all... my All my friends were obsessed with it, but I wasn't. <laughs> so it made it hard to play it with them. Oh, what? Also, I haven't been lifting weights this whole time. I think it's the fastest I've ever done this part. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> 
I forgot those lasers were there. Such a good run of that room. <laughs> oh. Um, which one? The one in the the one on the top left, the bars, or the so the one in the middle? I think is the timer. And then the one on the top left is, um, bullet time. Uh, I think that's just the timer for the level. There's, there's also, uh, the game also has a bullet time mechanic, but I have it turned off. Um, I have it turned off for speedruns. Just because it, it slows you down way too much. I mean, that's how I usually do it. I usually do it that way. Oh, uh, boss time. So with this boss, um, you can either just fight him for a certain amount of time and then you automatically go to the next level, or you can, um, or you can hit him four times. I'm very bad at. There we go. Yeah, much like Hotline Miami, this game is, uh, very trippy. Stupid of me. Right in the face. Really? There we go. Such an awkward spot. So I could just deflect the bullet at him. <laughs> I guess that's the easier way to do that. I'm 
I'm getting better at deflecting the bullets. I didn't even know you could do that until after I beat the game already. So anytime I did it was on accident. Oh, speaking of getting shot in the face. Yeah, I beat, I beat this game without deflecting bullets and without using the slow-mo. Just because I, I, I didn't realize you could. I didn't really pay attention. <laughs> door by mistake. <laughs> Oh yeah, we're getting there. <laughs> nope. Yes, that should work. So normally when you're not playing in speed run mode, um, You watch like a VHS tape of, of you beating the level, kind of like in Super Meat Boy. But that gets turned off. This boss is pretty easy. Oh yeah, motorcycle time. Oh yeah, we got you. Get there. Luckily, there's a lot of safe spots in this level, but.
We got it going on. Asshole. We gotcha, we gotcha. I still haven't got that down yet. know if you can hit him like that. I thought I saw someone in the speedrun do it, but... Gotcha. Also, the first time I beat this level, I, uh... I didn't know you had to deflect the bullet back at him. And it took me forever. <laughs> there we go. Also, I believe this game was made in Game Maker, which is really cool. I used to make games for Game Maker. Alright. I don't know why I did that. That's not the way you do it. You do this. Bam. Hit the window. He comes in. Everyone else comes in. Gack them all. That's the part that always gets me, is those two guys in the hallway like that. I don't know what I'm doing right now. That was lucky. stuck in a loop.
There's so many, so many dudes aggro so hard. We got this, folks. We got it. Good, 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 good. Get out of here, coppers. That last guy on the list every time. Then the robot gets me. <laughs> uh. That was close. Yeah.
There we go. That one took a minute. So this is like a secondary character that you play as for one level, and they have the ability to just run in a straight line like that. This part had me for a while. Come on. Keep forgetting to let it recharge. Like, where did that come from?
Alright, we got this, y'all. What up, Echo? How you doing? How's your morning going? What? It is Wednesday, isn't it? <laughs> it's been a long ass week already, let me tell you. <laughs> um, doing good. 6.30 in the morning, so not a lot's happened so far. <laughs> uh, yeah, Trisha's got her, uh... Oh, I did it! No, I didn't do it. Okay. Science bitches. I love science bitches, like... Like scientists in, like, sexy lab coats and stuff. <laughs> the um Yep. Um interview at 3.30, so I get half day from work so I can uh let her get ready and then um wash the babies. Sexy lab goes. No, what do you mean you've been doing science? I only have one baby? That we know of. I did a lot back in the 60s, let me tell you. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Bounce the egg? How do you do that? <laughs> you saw you soak the egg in something, right? I I think I've done it before. It's been a long time. Oh right, right, but yeah. I was thinking borax, but that's how you make slime, right? <laughs> it's been a while since I've been a scientist. Oh. <laughs> slime is borax. I mean, why not? It's so much fun. <laughs> corn, fl corn flour. Is that like? Is that the same thing as corn starch or corn meal? You know, I haven't done any reps this entire time. Just because I've been trying to... Corn, corn starch? Word. What am I doing here? Everything else is called flour. We got almond flour, we got regular flour, bread flour, 
flour soup, flour sandwich, flour gumbo. Uh, 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 I meant to type in reps reset. I need some better channel points myself. Yeah, look, the other day I have, I think I have almost 30,000 channel points for you. Uh, <laughs> what did I pause in the middle of? <laughs> single time. Try to go in the back door, you know what I mean? Yeah, I know, 3,000 is a lot. So I, ne I never spend them. So I'm like, what, make you stretch? <laughs> guy. Oh, my heart. <laughs> Spending. I'm going to make you hydrate until you get water toxicity. <laughs> Death by channel points, it's the new ice cream flavor. <laughs> nah, I could never I could never kill my co parent. expenses. Yeah, uh, excuse me, Ickle, could you uh, fill out your expense reports, please, and uh, send them to Susan in the main corporate office by Monday. Um, Ickle, we've noticed that there's a lot of Maltesers on your expense report. Now, were these for business snacks or... 
<laughs> what kind of stuff do you get to expense? Like gas? Petrol? <laughs> uh, the presents from our clients? Petrol. Who is left? Oh, yeah. <laughs> New diary. What do you use the diary for? Appointments. Like um like a planner. I thought you said dairy at first. You're like, I, <laughs> I can claim petrol and milk. But that's all. Slammer. Hello. Oh, right in the mouth. <laughs> I'm hoping. I mean, I only have half day at work, but I'm hoping it's pretty chill. I got my I got my case load down to six yesterday, which is very low for me. So I just happened to close a lot of cases yesterday. I'll probably spend all day nagging my boss for a raise. I, was, I became eligible for a raise on December 13th, so we're getting close to a month where they haven't processed my paperwork for it. That's the government, everything moves very slowly. <laughs> died 217 207 times this run which is also which is also at the mercy of the government <laughs> oh I hate this part There we go. Well, 
What happens if I don't kill that guy and he's stuck on the other side of the lasers? <laughs> Can I do that? Hit him in, hit the first bullet, hit the second bullet, there we go. And then just get gas right in the mouth. <laughs> That's a lot easier. I don't know why they stand there. The, hey! Uh, hey, what are you doing for lunch today? You wanna go out? Like, oh no, I packed lunch. I'm trying to save some money, you know. Me and the wife eat out too much. Alright. That guy. What? I always forget that you can cut doors open with your sword, and I always open them, and I feel like the animation takes longer. This part sucks really bad. I get some reps in quick. Why don't you like this game? You like you like games like this though, where it's like trial and error.
Yeah. So what do you got? If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. For reviews, creator development, and more, head over to EffectiveNerd.com. You can also follow us on social media at EffectiveNerd. Thank you for watching.